Ready. Uh, right, it's time for our first guest of the new season. It's Newcastle's Danny Simpson. Right, let's see Danny in action for the two nine. Baby Elvis shouted cross. I do it all the time in training. <laughs> the first of many goals. Yeah, it will be this Newcastle, season. Yeah. Uh, how are you? How's the buzz around Newcastle at the moment? Then? Yeah, the whole town's buzzing to be back in, in the, the big league. And uh, as I said, yeah, everyone just can't wait for Monday night. Um, whenever Sky Sports News go up to Newcastle, there's always so many fans just everywhere. It's in dangerous part. When you go to the training ground, are there like thousands in there? Yeah, it's just, it's just like their life. The whole, everyone, that's it. Just, they just love football, everyone. Um, kids, you know, everyone, um, all girls, lads, everyone just loves that's all they live for, um, just for the, for, the, for the match day. So Monday night, Man United, your former club and you're injured. Ooh. Yeah, I'm gutted. That was um, the one game I was looking forward to, but as I said, I can't play. And, um, but I'm sure, you know, the lads, the lads are all up for it and looking forward to it. Are you going to go? No, I'm not going to go. Ooh. Ooh, too bitter. Because, <laughs> just what, just can't face it. <laughs> no, it's because it, I just, if it was there, I just want to be playing and... Um, I'd rather go when I go back. I want to be, you know, fit for, for playing. So, will you not go to team. any games, or it's just because it's. No, nah, I just go to club. home games, and obviously, yeah. I was thinking about going back, but, you know, to see some of my old I teammates. Say, surely you must know a load of people. Yeah, there, I spoke to them, but I'm just going to support my lads from, from in Newcastle. Okay. Right, I understand. Uh, it's been a long, tough summer for you, hasn't it? Yeah. Um, been on crutches for most of it? Yeah, I was on most of the summer. I had operation straight after the last game of the season. Um, so, yeah, I was just um, on crutches and couldn't really get about. Um, so how long before you're back then? I'd say next week if I could, but <laughs> <laughs> but nah, the physio's uh, I'm doing I'm doing well at the moment. I'm on track. It's supposed to be a six month injury, but I think I'll be back in a couple of months. And it's your ankle. Yeah. What have you done? Uh, ruptured my tendon. Ooh. So um, did that hurt? Doesn't sound nice. I, um, I, I didn't actually know I'd done it. And um, I was playing. I knew my ankle was was something. It was sore. I knew um, I know I had to go for operation, but. They just told me it was going to be a tidy up, but when he actually opened me up, it was uh, ruptured. So, OK, well, good luck with that. Um, you've been loansies all round the place for a few years, but you did start at Manchester United, and you made your Manchester United debut September 2007, coming on as a sub in a cup game. What was that moment like when Sir Alex turns round to you and says, you, you're on? Cack yourself. <laughs> <laughs> what? Because you Sir Alex is pointing at you, or because you know it's. Yeah, because you don't obviously he's giving he's giving you a chance. That's what you wanted as a as a boy to as a United fan to play. A man you obviously at Old Trafford, and you know you never you never actually think you're going to get that chance. And you know when he said I'm going on, and then I did a cat myself and just just I didn't, don't really remember much of it. Just I remember yeah. just being on there and. Because you lost the game, didn't you? Yeah. Well. Yeah. Not you. But the no, no. Um, you lost it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, it was Coventry, wasn't it? In the cup. Yeah, yeah. Lost um, yeah, you weren't too. Did pleased. you know that? Did you know that you were were going on though? Did he say to you beforehand, "Look, you will get, you'll get at least ten minutes here or there." Did he speak to you and tell no, you? No, no, he didn't. Definitely. He didn't. So you were sat on the bench, just thinking, "Please, please, 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 please." Yeah, just waiting. Just Are stalling. you hoping for an injury? Because I, if I'm on the bench, you can't say that. You can't just say that. Muscles, <laughs> nah, you don't. Because obviously, you are your teammates, but obviously, you, you just can't wait to get on. And you said he wasn't too pleased afterwards. Did he? What did he say to you personally? No, it was all right with me, to be honest. Okay, <laughs> I, yeah. didn't do too, I didn't do too bad, but no, uh, me, he wasn't happy, and he gave some lads. Some lads went home crying, I think. Oh no! Okay. Like, really? And was was that the first? <laughs> yeah, time? obviously, obviously, everyone was upset. You know, I'd have a good cup one. Um, it was the first game, um, and we got knocked out, and you know, our lads were disappointed, and he was disappointed in us. Was that the first time you, that you'd experienced that side of Sir Alex, obviously sitting there in the dressing room having him saying, and you did this and you did that? Was there anything that you thought, wow, I didn't expect no, it to be I said, like that? No, you hear about the, the stories, but that was the first time I'd actually witnessed it. Hair dryer? <laughs> yeah, yes. something like that. Do you fancy speaking up? Do you fancy going, actually, I think, you know? No, I couldn't. It's not, it's not worth it. <laughs> <laughs> um, and you said of all, the, of all the people at Man United that you trained with and played with, Skulls was the best? Yeah, he's honestly he's just a magician. He's a, he's a joke. You won't actually watch him in training. 
Like, no one can get near him. Even now, you know, obviously he's, he's got a few years left, but even now, I can't imagine what it was like 10 years ago, but when you see him in training and stuff, he's, he, just, he just keeps the ball all day. It's too easy. Um, some of the Newcastle players, obviously well, they're growing moustaches until you win a, a game. Um, I think we've got a, a few of them. Oh, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Andy Carroll's gone wispy there. <laughs> Oh, brilliant! I haven't seen those before. There's a little part of me that really, I mean, it'd be great if Newcastle just didn't win for like 20 weeks and they'd be massive yeah. great for starters. Why have right. you not joined in? Or have you? Let's get a bit of bum for yeah. <laughs> yeah. I can't really grow one. Uh, all right, we've got plenty more to ask you, but we're just going to finish off for now saying um, we saw your goal against Peterborough uh, earlier on. It was the well, we were going to say it was the one and only last season, but you did get one other goal last season, yeah, didn't you? Here it is. <laughs> oh, Danny. Oh, <laughs> now, in a word, whose fault was that? Obviously, Jose. It was Jose's yeah, fault. It's always oh, his fault. <laughs> okay. Uh, Danny Simpson, everyone. Thank you.